I've never seen a Nike catcher's glove before. Yeah, well, I got I asked for this one this year in this colorway, and you know, it's fire. It's yeah, it really is fire. Luis Camposano, San Diego Padres. Today, I'm gonna show you a few things of what I have when I like. Um, start off with this Nike mint. Um, it was actually a gift from Nike last year around this time during spring training, and you know. Um, it's taken me, you know, about up until this time to break it in, but right now where it's at, I really, really love it. I use Rawlings, but you know, Nike giving out like this nice, nice leather. I mean, you just can't help but not use it. I've never seen a Nike catcher's glove before. Yeah, well, I got, I asked for this one this year in this colorway, and you know, it's fire. It's yeah, it really is fire. Um, but it'll it'll take some time for me to break it in. But yeah, these are uh, two Can of the mitts I'm working on. Inside of it too. Yeah. So Shadow Elite J. Yeah, I mean, the leather and the quality of it is really, really, really good. Yeah, I mean, it's amazing. Yeah. I think, I've never seen it before, and I know the Nike heads are gonna absolutely go nuts when they see it. Yeah, <laughs> when they I see mean, that. the leather is just. Have you worn it in a game yet? Yeah, I've yeah. used it a few times. Uh, not uh, yesterday, I used my Rawlings, but um, yeah, I've just been giving it a, a try, you know, but it's got a couple clanks in it, but um, I'll kind of iron that out as it goes. Yeah, is it something, like how long does it usually take you to break one Ooh, in? I mean, like I said, I got this mitt last year around this time and I've been using it since. So, I mean, just even squeezing it, it's still a little bit, but the form is nice. I love it, love how that looks. Good framing mitt. Just get a few more Darvish splitters in the, on there. Yeah, <laughs> well, the loud noises helps too, you know. <laughs> um, Pitches like that, huh? Oh, of course, Yeah, of course. And then uh, a few of my bats that I'm swinging with, I kind of go on and off with brands, but uh, more so like kind of day in the field, you know, what I want to swing with and what feels good in my hands. Looks um, like it's an ax bat, huh? Yeah, this is an ax handle bat, Victus, um, LC5. This is actually after a Josh Harrison model with Louisville. And uh, they just made me, you know, same specs and all, 35, 32 and a half. Birch too? Yeah, Birch. Birch and Maple, I kind of go on and off. I wish they had some uh, some ash, but you know we'll get get that going here. So bit. you you would like to swing ash if you could. Oh, I love ash. Yeah, what I started you... using maple in 2020. Um, before then, all ash. But uh, what's this? Is there like a shortage or? I think they just don't make them anymore. Yeah. Some back companies just don't make them. Um, actually, I talked to my guy with Overfly, and. Uh, he made me this really cool piece right here. It's ash, actually. It does look, yeah, it looks like ash. Yeah, and it's a Jeff McNeil handle. Just something to try out. Like, I like having options and, you know, just trying to see what fits, Beautiful. you know, and what feels good that day. And, you know, not every day I feel great. So that's, just, just kind of adjust in and, That's you know. a Longoria, like, flame-treated mm -hmm. look. I like that a lot. Yeah, so it's one of them I'm working with. It's one of my ash bats I have. And then uh, into the Rawlings. So, a couple of Rawlings mitts that I got this year. Um, after my dog, one of them, Pablo. It's another something I've never seen before, the mm -hmm. embroidery over the Rawlings like that. Yeah, yeah, it's different. Um, it's the, the date I got them. You Your know. dog? Yeah, what kind my of dogs dog? mean everything to me, so. What, what kind? Uh, two Frenchies. Pablo and then another one, Cookie. <laughs> yeah, so. It's awesome. I, I just got a puppy too. I think about them. My babies. Are they are they here? Or are they, where mm -hmm. are they? Yeah. They are. Yeah. I'm missing mine right now. That's yeah. for sure. Uh, oh, what's the, what's the model on that? Uh, this is a CM43. I see that inside of CM43. Mm -hmm. Okay. Yeah, I think that's like the standard, like Buster Posey. Mm hmm. Yeah, I mean, it feels great. I mean, I've been using this mitt, this model for a few years now, and it's been working out well for me. I noticed you got a black one and a white one with both Nike and Nike, uh, I'm sorry, Rawlings. Is there a difference between those two as far as oh, how yeah, they break Oh, yeah, for sure. Um, you know, with the leather, obviously, you know, it's, it's obviously like I could break this mitt in, I feel like, in a few weeks versus like having something like this that could take me, you know, almost a year. <laughs> Really? You know, yeah. I mean, and, you know, 
as I don't know if you know, but like, you know, when you get hard mitts like this and, you know, it takes a while for them to break in, you know, the longevity of them after they get broken in, I mean, they're going to last forever, you know. Um, not to say that Pro Preferred isn't going to do the same thing either, but, you know, just different, you know, different leathers on here. Yeah. So, um, but yeah, I, I mean, my go-to, honestly, would be Rawlings. Um, always, always use Rawlings and, you know, I can't, you know, not have enough of it. So it's, it's, it's done me well and, you know, I'll continue to use it and, you know, having like love deals isn't like a, a thing to me because it's more important to have than just bats, you know. I think this is more important for me to have. I like to have this, you know, be an extension of me and, you know, I want to catch everything, block everything and keep everything in front, you know. So I, the trust in gloves, you know, is really, really important for me. So, but yeah. How about this thing right here? Yeah, that's just more of a wrist guard. Kind of, you know, have it on and... You know, sometimes like in between pitches, you know, kind of be a little lazy, kind of give your hand a little break. Um, okay. But you know, it's just something to secure it and you know hold it. But I mean, and yeah, on like a ball in the dirt when you yeah, for sure. Over. I get a lot of those, especially off my thumb. This protects my thumb pretty well. You know, you, you see like other catchers use it too. And growing up, you know, I'd like to you know be like one of those catchers. So it's, you know, Yadier Molina, you know, same guy who uses them too. And you know, it makes sense why he uses them too. So yeah. That's that's really what I'm working with right now, and it's um, I'd say, say let's go with the cleats. I don't have any fresh cleats, but uh, so with these, I'm not a big high top guy, um, just because I like to feel really flexible with my ankles and have a lot, you know, as much ankle mobility as much as I possibly can. So um, these are like the the new waves of uh, Hirachis high tops um they're really nice i love the color and the combo and the style of course but you know you know my preference is obviously you know going to be more of a, a low top just to fill it in my ankles but i mean this this cleat right here itself it's just really really nice and you know i love it nike's been taking care of me and um you know got nothing but good things to say about them how about um, those white the, the 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 white ones there right here yeah, yeah that so looks like, like a new yeah, one these too. are more like game like a little dirty, but this is more of my go to, you know, kind of like the loose ankle sock. Yeah. Um, kind of feels like, you know, uh, low tops. So, I mean, they feel great on my feet and, you know, I have kind of narrow feet, so they, they, they match well, really well. Um, but yeah, I mean, this is what I rock with. I mean, honestly, if I can go to all whites all year, I mean, I'll do it too. You know, I think white's a clean color. It goes Absolutely, with everything. as long as you can keep it clean. Yeah. That, but you got the <laughs> long longevity stock to help of you them too, right? That, right? <laughs> um, I got one question for you. Last yeah. question. It's a fan question. The question is, what is your favorite snack? My what's favorite your, snack. What's your favorite snack? Um, I'd say my favorite craving would be ice cream. Uh, ice cream. I could eat ice cream any time of the day. Um, Do you have a, sp a specific flavor? Yeah, cookies and cream. Oreo, all of that mix. I could eat. I had that actually yesterday before I went to bed. Um, yeah, it's like an everyday thing. I, I enjoy just something cold, a nice treat. Just enjoy, and yeah, that's, that's what I love.